The Athlete's Secret Weapon. Get it wherever books are sold. Good morning. How are you? My friends, it's Coach Vig. This is a Power Yoga Morning Energy Flow. And this is part of my huge Power Yoga Conditioning Challenge program. The link to all of the workouts is on the screen and the About section below. Make sure you bookmark that. And whenever you're sharing these videos with friends, family, and online, mention Sean Vig Fitness or tag me. However that works. I don't usually sleep in capris, but when I do, I feel like doing a morning flow. So this is great for everyone. Modify as needed. Check in below. Let me know you're training with me this fine morning. And I love this structure back here. I walk by it a lot. It's very old. I'm trying to figure out what it was. Maybe a horse stable, maybe a shed. But it's, uh, I'm very honored to have that in the background. That's the, the historian in me coming out. Okay, let's go. Okay, let's feel refreshed. Start our day with some deep breaths, some power yoga flows to really focus for the best possible day. Perhaps this is the best day ever. So let's begin on our backs. Bring the knees into the chest, breathing in the nose and out the nose. I don't sleep in my cap, but it's hot in the sun and all that. Okay, let's rock it side to side. In the nose, out the nose. Wiggle the fingers and the toes. I hope I don't have to rhyme for the rest of the time. There's another one. I have to start doing limericks here. Good. Drop the legs back and forth. Lying spinal twist. Exhale, drop. Inhale to the center. Loosen up your lower back. Let's invigorate invigorate the mind and the body and perhaps even the spirit and see if we can make it through this session without Addy attacking me. The clouds all of a sudden came out. Okay, figure four, take the right ankle, top of the left thigh, reach the arms through, let's pull head up or down and rock side to side. Back and forth. Use this right elbow to open up the hip a little bit more. If we can start to release our body, our mind will follow. It really does. They are inseparable, the mind and the body. So the more you can bring them together, you will move and live and feel and everything so much clearer. Okay, one more breath. Rocking side to side. Now switch. Left ankle on the right thigh. Capris. Keep an eye on Addy. Rocking back and forth. Good. Get some blood flow. Very important. Always getting more blood flow to the muscles, to the body, to the brain. Deep breathing in the nose, out the nose. Breathe into the deep abdominals. One more breath. Okay. Knees in, one more. Lovely move down here. Take the hands to the knees, let's circle. Around and around. Churning the abdominals, massaging the lower back. And other direction. Man, no clouds. I came out here, massive clouds. They are pretty. Two more circles. Okay, rolling onto your side and press up. Addy's way over there now, okay. <laughs> modified, modified, modified vinyasa flow. Let's press back child's pose. Let's get some movement going, some flow. Inhale forward, modified plank. Press forward, lower down, all the way down to the mat or the bed, tops of the feet on the mat. Forearms down, baby cobra. Shoulders back, getting a nice back bend to start. Lower down, exhale, child's pose. Long stretch for the spine. Your body's warm, it's relaxed. Let's do that once again. Forward, modified plank, and down. Baby cobra, forearms down, lift, shoulders back. Pull them back a little more. Now as you lower, feel that stretch in your spine. Well, it's a crappy job. <laughs> Let's go back to child's pose. Extra breath. 
shoulders are back. Now popping up into downward facing dog. Let's walk the legs. We got mud on the mat from Addy. I got mud on my, on my, whatever. <sighs> mud on my face, I'm a big disgrace. Walk out the legs, get some mobility in the lower back. Got the sun out again, but for how long we don't know. But what does that matter? All right, four more steps. One, two, three, and four. Let's bring the left foot forward. Low lunge, slide that right knee back. Take the hands together. Shoulders down, we got mud on the arm, I like that. I say if you don't get dirty working out, what's the point? <laughs> now take the arms out, we're gonna twist it back and forth. Exhale, twist, inhale, center. Other side, let's do it four more times, each side. Shoulders back and down, you can turn your palms forward to really open up the chest. A lot of balance. Oh, my counting. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry for my poor counting. I'm going to do it one more time each side. Now, left hand to the left uh, hip here and reach the right arm up and back. So you get a big stretch down the abdominals, down the side. Hinge forward a little further. Activate your right hip flexor. And then reach the arms up, back bend. Oh, palms together. Set the hands down. Step back down, dog. Shake it out. And let's take the right foot forward. Low lunge. Ow, I got a little mat burn on my knee. Shoulders back. Slide that left knee back a little further. Arms out. Let's twist it back and forth five times. One. There goes our sun. And two. I'm counting this time, I got you. There's three, let's do it two more times. Churning the energy, churning it. Get the breath going. And then to the center, right hand on the hip, reach the left arm up and over. Hinging forward, activate that hip flexor. You'll be glad you did. One more breath. Oh, beautiful. Arms up, reaching back. And palms together. Good, activating the legs, planting the feet. And let's take it through a full vinyasa flow. Let's step back first to down dog. We keep building, getting stronger and stronger and muddier and muddier. Inhale forward to plank. You can put the knees down if you want. If not, lower down, hover. Cobra, shoulders back or lift up to upward facing dog. Squeeze the glutes, the tops of the thighs. Woo! Exhale, downward facing dog. Now take the left foot forward. We're going to turn. This is a wide legged twist. So shoulders back and down. Do, 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 bah. Fatality. And dive down. We're going to reach and lift. Inhale up, exhale to the center. Just like that. Let's do eight more. And up. Draw that arm back. Three. We're going to eight. Here's four. Inhale up, exhale down. F five. Man, got to get my focus. And six, two more, seven, you feel that limberness in the lower back. It really elevates your mood. And eight, bring it down, extra breath, sinking lower. Now, turn it to lunge. Okay, now full twist, arms out, let's do five times. One, two, stabilize, three, Exhale to the side, four, five, six, we're going to 10 actually, seven, oh my God, eight, nine, and 10. So yeah, take the arms up, 
again, turn, and let's do 10 more of those twists. Reach the arm a little further across. Inhale up, exhale down. Two, three, four, five, go on to 10, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Diving down, ring out the spine, and then turn so the right foot is in front. Oh, coming up to that lunge. Take the arms out. We're gonna twist it 10 times total. Here we go, one. Oh, balance, two, up, oh, three, Eddie's on the move, four, five, six, seven, eight, sun's coming, nine, and 10. Very good, let's turn it all the way across. Take it through that vinyasa flow. Step back to plank, press forward, lower down. Cobra or up dog. Little hip dips, love these. Keep your lower back limber, keep the energy flowing. Okay, downward facing dog. Walk the legs a few times, stretch it out. Twist it. Feel that stretch down the outsides of your legs and your IT band. Okay, take that left foot forward. Lunge, low or full. We're doing a cat cow. Let me put my right foot down. It's on some kind of, I don't know, shoulders back and down, arms up. We're gonna exhale, round forward. Inhale, lift. Let's do five more. Round it. Exhale, squeeze out the shoulders. Inhale, open. And lift, three more. Good, squeeze out the shoulders, all the breath, filling and emptying the lungs one more time. Open, draw the arms back, lace the fingers, mudra, open up the breath. Uh oh, someone hiking through here. <laughs> Take the arms up, vinyasa flow. Let's go through, step back, down. Up dog, lift, lift tall, and then downward facing dog, excellent. Take the right foot forward, lunge, let's do that. Cat, cow, six times, get the lunge first. Exhale, inhale, one, oh, slippery mat. Two. Three, three more. Four. Five, one more time, what's Addy doing? And open, Woo. nice big opening. Take the arms up for a moment and then whew, mudra. Sink those shoulders down so the breath can flow, opening up the posture. Okay, arms up, vinyasa flow. Down we go, kick the leg back if you like, that's up to you. Up dog, down dog. Okay, walk or jump the feet forward. Let me step back a little bit, shake it out. We're gonna do a little balance. Tree with active arms. I'll mirror you, open up your left hip. Bring the heel below or above the knee. We have the hands together. Focus, focus the eyes, focus the breath. Now, take the arms up. Hold it in the extended tree. What well, we're gonna do five arm movements. We do cactus arms, exhale, open. I'm just gonna stare at the camera. Inhale, reach up, there's one. Two, going to five. Challenge that balance, stability, and motion. Three.
four. One more time. Open, open, open. Lengthening through the top of the head. Oh, and the arms come up, a little wobbly. That's good, always challenging. Bring the hands back down in front of the chest. Extra breath. All that oxygen coming into the body. Fix the blouse, and let's take it right to the other side. I don't wanna know what Addie's eating. Okay, stabilize. I'm gonna look at the tripod this time. Arms up, hold, or five movements with the arms. Stability in motion. As the arms move, our core rushes in to stabilize the body so it does not move. Definitely something we do all day long, from the biggest movements to the smallest. Always stabilizing. Once more, bend the elbows a little further. Open, 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 and then the arms come up. Hope you enjoyed that one. Bring the hands together or rather bring the hands in front of the chest. Take a deep breath. All right, set the foot down, kick it back. Downward facing dog, walk with the twist. Twist it out. Okay, we're just gonna do one more. I have one more movement here. There's so much to do, so little time, but I'm just gonna keep adding to this power yoga conditioning challenge. Remember that link is in the about section below. So many power yoga workouts for anything you need. Okay, left foot forward. Reverse warrior. Turn this right foot in, bend this left knee. Take the arm up and back. Stretch it out. People are walking. Okay, now inhale, take the arms out. Fingers down and extend. This is proud warrior, extended warrior. Inhale, reach up. And again, exhale, down. Let's do it four more times. Six each one. All right, there's three. Three more. Reach and extend. Take it one more time. Lift up and extend, extra breath. And then set the hands down, step back to plank, vinyasa flow, up dog, and downward facing dog. Take a breath. Okay, let's finish it off. Right foot forward. Reverse warrior, bend that right knee, reach back, reach back. Forward, forearm on the leg or fingers down. Six times total, that's one. Big stretch for the upper body while engaging the legs. Two. Good, stretch it out. Three, three more times. Total control. Arms out, reach, and down. Let's take it once more. Up and back. Forward down, extend, extra breath. Beautiful, hands down. Take it through your flow one more time. I think we're ready for the day. We are ready. At least the sun's out. There it goes. All right, down dog. Walk or jump forward. Chin to the chest. Let's rise up. Stacking, stacking, stacking. Three shoulder rolls. Ought to do it. Hope you enjoyed this session. Leave your feedback below, check in below, just say hi or anything you want to say. And uh, whew, what an honor that was to do this routine with you. We suffered, we had muddy, we got poop on us, but we keep flowing every darn day. Thanks for training with me. It's Coach V and Addie over there. Um, she's scooting down the hill. And uh, this is part of my big power yoga challenge. Conditioning challenge, link is up there, about section below. Subscribe to never miss a workout. Please hit the like button if this workout helped. I appreciate that and share it with everyone you know. At least three people each day share these workouts. And next time you're at Barnes and Noble or Books A Million or Amazon, wherever you buy your books, pick up a copy of this book that I wrote a couple years ago that will definitely help you in your power yoga journey.
on my best-selling book, Power Yoga for Athletes, over 100 yoga poses for all ages and fitness levels, as well as 25 complete yoga flows and training logs for all the major sports. Get your copy today, or perhaps you do better with four copies. Hehe, <laughs> I own this guy. Thank <laughs> you.